people have said that everything in Freud is in Shakespeare. But the thing about, about Shakespeare is that nothing in Shakespeare is explicit. It's still all story, right? He was a great spinner of drama. And all Shakespeare's plays, plays, which is re a reference to behavior, all Shakespeare's plays are images of patterns of action. You could say what Freud did, insofar as you grant his theorizing credence, is make an, an image of a pattern of behavior explicit representation from the perspective of semantics, from the perspective of words. Well, it's the same with myths. I mean, myths are full of wisdom about behavior that hasn't yet been made explicit. And now, the problem with us, of course, is that we think, well, you know, our heads are full of a lot of bizarre nonsense, and that makes it very difficult for us to figure out what myths mean. 